moving in there all set the last of them away green light is through the bunny's on its way all set for race four ready Racing favourite glittering gold only fairly away but it's got plenty of room to move and go to the lead so it should be able to show the goods from there. My only boy is moving up they were followed by Spacer Richard Bale for the back in the race now was cool hooch and the tail end of fun for all. Down the back this is why it's been the twos on because glittering gold is a dozen in front make it 15. Second at the moment is needle point Richard Bale is running home fairly. They were followed next in the run by Armorina only my only boy tell you what the leader needed to break glittering gold is walking to the line it's going to win glittering gold scores by three second in the race was richard bale and a third up on the inside was uh, armorina only followed by needle point next up was my only boy cool hooch and spacer well glittering gold appeared as though it was going to space them but uh <laughs> tell you what i'm glad it was i'm glad it was a bit better part of 15 in front down the back uh three the white glittering gold is first eight the pink richard bale second Won the Red Arm Arena, Raleigh's run third at number seven has wound up fourth. Well, he won a glittering goal by Goodsey out of Eureka Girl is owned by Ray Roby and trained by Justin King of Wilberforce. Richard Bale, Simon Rhodes and Armorina only. Michael Cronitis filled the minors. Three and a half by one and three quarters. Three and a half by one and three quarters of the margins. And the time for the journey was uh, 30 and 68. 30 and 68 is the time recorded by Glittering Gold.